Okay, we're going to try some partial differentiation. We've got this uh, function here. It's a fairly straightforward function. It's x squared plus x times y plus y squared plus 1. Um, so we want to find the first, um, the two first partial derivatives. That is the derivative of f with respect to x and the derivative of f with respect to y. Now, when we work these things out, when we work out df dx, we pretend that all other variables are constants. So like in your head, you can just substitute the value three um, and, and figure out what happens. So differentiate this function with respect to x, pretending that y is a constant. x squared goes to two times x x times y. y is a constant, so differentiate x times a constant, you just get the constant. Differentiate y squared. Remember, y is a constant, so y squared is a constant. That differentiates to zero because you're differentiating with respect to x. One is a constant. It differentiates to zero anyway, so this is it. We're done. That's the first derivative of f with respect to x. With respect to y, we do the same thing. x squared is a constant with respect to y. Right? x varies with x. Right? It's a, it's a variable in itself, but it's constant with respect to y. So that's zero. x times y, well, you're going to get a contribution because it's got a y on there. You're just going to get x. Uh, from the two y from the y squared term, you're going to get two y plus one. Just get a constant. All right, you get it's it's a constant. You differentiate a constant. That's zero. So that's the first derivative of f with respect to y.